Hello guys and girl, welcome back to Rainbow's Mood. Some of us are tired of gay movies with sad endings. We have 10 gay movie recommendations with happy endings, so no more sad tears at the end. There are some movies with happy endings that we don't mention here, because we've already included them in other movie recommendations. Please check out our other videos. Let's go to the list. I'll make you a deal. If in 10 years we're both still single, we'll be a couple together forever. The 10 Years Plan is gay romantic comedy focuses on two best friends who tried to postpone the inevitable. Miles and Brody are best friends. Miles is a hopeless romantic looking for the right one. Brody is a sexy player who always hooks up with a lot of guys. They'll be together if both of them are still single in 10 years. After almost 10 years, the two avoided becoming a couple. But you know how it ends, fate says otherwise. That was incredible. <laughs> Thanks. Russell is a typical teenage high schooler trying to come to terms with his sexuality. He tries to hook up with a woman named Trish. Meanwhile, Kevin is a star of the football team with a secret of his own to hide. As the title suggests, their school's geography club is a place where another story takes place. Russell has a lot of friends who support him there, with all the complexities in it, this film has a happy ending. You're a natural at this, I thought you should do modeling. I didn't know this was the kind of modeling you had in mind. Adam has been driven from New York to Los Angeles to join his bestie, Candy. Hoping to be famous but instead have to work hard, whether to be a money boy or a helper in one of the porn studios. Adam was close to one of the photographers named Nick, but he was a crook. Then he eventually falls in love with one of his wealthy clients, a popular actor in a TV series at Middle America. The ending of this film made me happy. From beginning to end tells the story of two brothers Francisco and Thomas. They are develop a very close relationship as they are growing up in a happy family. When they are young adults their relationship becomes very romantic and intimate. The father worries it might eventually turn sexual, but the mother accepts it for whatever it is. Such a deep film with a happy ending. You guys must watch it. We're from the Church of Jesus Christ. Just a moment. Honey? Stacy, you'll want to hear this. What have we here? Latter Days tells the story about Aaron and Christian, the two most opposite people in the world. Aaron is a Mormon missionary who wants to make his family proud. Meanwhile, Christian is a shallow party boy who is only looking for men to date them. Christian was asked by his friend to approach one of the three Mormon boys, he chose Aaron. All the problems culminate here, questioning sexuality, regret, loss, but it all ends happily. This movie tells the story of Justin, a college gay man discovers how to love himself. His father is homophobic, and his mother had nothing to do with it. Fast forward after one particularly harmful stunt, he ends up in the hospital emergency room, and he meets a sweet male nurse, Michael. They are getting closer, but there are so many obstacles for them. Until finally the happiness came. The counselor says that he's in denial, that he hasn't accepted what's happened. But if I just want to be the same old me that I was before. 
This movie is an inspiring story of Morgan Oliver, a gay athlete determined that a bicycle accident that left him paralyzed. He takes a chance on love when he meets Dean, the two strike up a friendship that quickly develops into a romantic connection. There is a lot to learn from Morgan during his time with Dean, he dared to admit his mistakes and make peace with himself. This is a comedy movie, happy endings usually happen in this genre. Paul has a sister, Alana. There will be Alana's engagement event at their house, the vacation will be done with Alana's good friends, Roy and Vicky. Roy is Paul's ex-boyfriend. Roy invites his friend Gavin to pretend to be his boyfriend, but then Gavin is attracted to Paul. All this romance and comedy stuff really cheers up my day. The way he looks is the story about Leonardo, a blind teenager who is dealing with his overprotective mother. He plans to go on an exchange program abroad, even though his best friend Giovanna is disappointed. Gabriel is a new student in town, arriving at their classroom. Leonardo and Gabriel grow closer making Leo doubt his plans for an overseas exchange program. A sad movie to see the blind Leonardo, but also heartwarming because it has a happy ending. This movie is a story about Seeger, a quiet and sporty 15-year-old boy who discovers love during the summer. He is training in the new athletics team for a championship, he meets the handsome and unpredictable Mark. The two of them grew closer and liked each other. Mark's jealousy when Seeger was with Jessica, Seeger tried to avoid Mark, but he couldn't lie to himself. With all the sadness they both face, it all ends sweetly on a motorbike. A must-watch movie. Those are 10 gay movie recommendations with happy endings. It's a relief when the movie ends with the smiles of two people who love each other. I hope you like Rainbow's Moods recommendation. Press like if this video is useful, subscribe for more recommendations. Thanks for watching and have a beautiful day.